Good icons are what every designer needs out there, so in this video I'm going to show you some of my favorite icon libraries, which are of course free. Hey designer, Alex here, welcome to the channel and before we jump into today's video make sure to check out my membership, link is going to be down in the description below. Membership includes all of my courses, digital design products, private access to the Facebook group, practice files for my YouTube tutorials and so much more. So if you're interested in content like that make sure to check it out once again, link is going to be down in the description below. So the first resource of the day is feathericons.com and before we move on any further, links to all of the resources I'm going to mention are going to be down in the description below. Make sure to check them out if you want to easily access them. So as I mentioned, feathericons.com and this website is great because you can download all of these icons and they are SVG of course. You can change their sizes, you can change the stroke width and you can switch the current color. So if I choose something like, I don't know, let's try this. So 3EC6FF for nice blue color. You can switch all of them to this color if that's your client's color, for example, or your brand's color. And you can click download all to download all of these icons as SVG. If we click on this one, I can simply download it straight away. So if you don't want to download all of these icons, but perhaps just this icon, then you can do it just that. Finally, they are on GitHub and you can see what, uh, what is the version of these icons and you can click get started to learn more about these icons. You can click the usage so Feather Icons uh, is a collection of SVG files. This means that you can use Feather Icons in all the same ways you can use all other SVG and you can find the helpful integration right here. You can use them uh, with JavaScript, for example, uh, how you can use them, what does it require with Node and all of these things. So once again, feathericons.com, do check it out. It's a fantastic resource. Next up, we have heroicons.com. And once again, you can see it's a collection of 230 icons MIT licensed so you can check out what that means react plus view libraries if you want to use those they have outline and they have solid ones right here so you can copy SVG and you can paste it into your design if you want to and you can get a Figma file and there is also a github documentation right here they're all 24 by 24 which is great if you're working with 8 pixel grids and they're also 2 pixel stroke weight and they also have boundary box with 24 by 24 pixels which is fantastic but solid fills are 20 by 20 and they are designed at 20 by 20 so just make sure to pay attention to that if you're working with something like 8 or 4 pixel grid systems but you can see there are many of them and for every one of them you can copy JSX or you can copy SVG and you can paste it straight into your designs once again heroicons.com do check it out Next up we have Eva icons. You can click download design pack or NPM right here. They are outline, they are fill, zoom, pulse, shake and flip in Y axis. So you can change all of these things for the animation. So if I click right here, you can see the activity and I can copy the SVG or I can copy the PNG and download it straight away. 480 uh, beautifully crafted open source icons for common actions and items. You can download the entire set on the desktop to use them in your digital products for web, iOS and Android. And it's compatible with Eva design system. So if you're not familiar, it's a great design system. It's really popular out there. So let's click and search for home, for example. And this is this icon for home. You can see how it looks like. Once again, I can click the SVG, it's going to start downloading right away. I can click the PNG, it's going to start downloading right away. So once again, evaicons.com, do check it out. I'm going to leave the link down in the description below. Next resource is iconssvg.xyz. So we have simple outline, we have the brand logo, we have the tritone. And if we go back to simple uh, outline, we have how it looks like right here. So I can switch between light and dark modes just to see how it looks like. So let's go back to light. Icon size 24, stroke is 2 and stroke color, you can change that. You can see how the ends look like, how the joints look like and you can download the SVG code right here to integrate it straight into your website. You can download the SVG icon to use it into uh, your design tool of choice like XD or Figma for example or you can copy the SVG code if that's easier for you. You can also paste it into your design software of choice. So once again you can 
can switch these you can get the generated code right here uh, both for svg jsx and react so depending on what you're working on this can be really helpful for your developers because they can simply take this code right away and integrate it straight into the design finally we have the stroke color as i mentioned so let's use that same color so 3 e c 6 ff for the blue and you can see that it changed the color to the blue which is really useful and you can use this current color for all of these other icons that you select and it's useful as i mentioned previously if you're working with clients on client projects and you want to integrate this color uh, as their brand color into the design so once again icons svg dot xyz do check it out and finally, last resource of the day is Line Awesome. It's by icons8.com forward slash line awesome. So you can download the entire zip because you don't have the option to download the icons individually. They are on GitHub. And uh, if we scroll down, so we have this accessible icon, for example, you can see it in different sizes. You can copy and paste into your design so you can copy the class but you cannot copy the svg straight from here so you can see the class and you can copy this html code if you want to use it directly there so if i select this one for example or this one i can see how it looks like and copy it straight into my design there are different categories right here so camping so i like this one for example i can click and download it and if i go right to here for example let's use this copy icon once again same story but uh, this time because uh, it's a bit different right here you can copy this one or this one depending on which icon do you want so once again line awesome if you want you can download the zip file or you can click the get started just to see how to install it you can load it from cdn downloadable version usage so you can use these different three styles you can see the preview page using in figma sketch photoshop etc so there are three files one for each style regular solid and brands if you want to use all icons please import all three files so line awesome do check it out so there we go those are the resources for this video if you like it make sure to press the like button make sure to subscribe to the channel i upload new videos every single week right here on the channel all about design adobe xd passive income techniques resources just like these ones so if you're interested in content like that make sure to subscribe and until next time take care